Hi everyone, welcome to this week's video. If you've not been here before, I'm Donna and I have a love of DIY. So I'm going to be working on three projects today, all using chalk paint, which I make up myself. The recipe for the chalk paint that I use is three parts paint, one part powder. I'm also using casting plaster, a fast set one, so I'm not sure whether that makes a difference for um, the use of normal plaster of Paris, but I've never had any problems with my one. Um, my first little project is a little brown jug, or what I've called the little brown jug. I actually really like this, and it has turned out fabulously, and I've just done maybe three or four coats of the chalk paint and just wiping in some um, wax, just some antique wax as a finish and that's it. Simple as and looks really effective. I also did give the cork a bit of a clean because it was pretty grubby but apart from that very easy flip. Oh, I forgot to add there that I actually did sand it um, down in between layers so it has got a beautiful smooth finish to it. Um, my next project that I'm working on is a bowl of types. A very brassy looking bowl it was, but it's, it's nice. Um, so essentially what I'm doing with this as well is just giving it layers of the chalk paint. Um, again, there was a few in there, maybe five on this one. As I did before in the last project, I sanded between each layer of the paint, so it's got a lovely smooth finish. Um, I've also added a lip of um, rub and buff gold around the top and sanded that back a little bit as well. Um, the reason I added the the rub and buff was I wanted to um, put something gold in there so I thought it would just lift it a little bit. Um, yeah, I am using a liquid max wax um, for this one. I actually prefer this to the other wax that I was using. It's much nicer. and goes on a lot easier. I'm really happy with how this turned out and I think that it looks absolutely fabulous um, with my um, resin love in it. The next project I didn't have a before photo and it I kind of picked it up mid project. It was a vase which is heavily textured that um, with the um, external designs but I have sprayed it black and done a couple of layers of um, dirt on there which has added even more texture and I think it's actually turned out really awesome. So you can see the dirt shining through, well not shining through, but showing through. So again I'm going in, I didn't sand this too much because I didn't want to take off um, too much of the white paint and the texture was supposed to be rough anyway so I've pretty much left it um, a little bit um, rough in places and a little bit smooth in other places. I haven't used a lot of chalk paint in my um, flipping. The only thing I've really done before is paint a um, sideboard that I use as a display cabinet in a local shop. I painted it black with gold trim and gold handles. It looks quite cool. Looking at the cabinet today, it does need a little bit of a tidy up, so I will do that soon. 
and you can't see the handles because I've taken all the doors off to use it as um, display but when it's at home I certainly have the all the doors back on I was using some brass which looks like gold alcohol ink on another um, project so I wondered what it would look like rubbed into the um, cracks so I rubbed a little bit into the bottom and I liked it so I continued all the way around the bottom and I also did it all around the top just to give it a bit of a highlight I guess to my right you can see a pile of Christmas decorations they're just about they're my next project on my list to get a little bit of a zhuzh um, they just need a bit of a touch up and then to go back and store again but if you want to watch the video on what how I upcycled uh, a lot of Christmas decorations I will flick a link in here for you to go and have a look and yeah there's several videos on um, Christmas decorations but I will link the ones that um, you can see in the picture I also did go in with um, some white paint afterwards on a dry brush just to tone it down a tad so it looks like it was underneath more than sitting on top Thanks for watching today. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, there are still a couple of pictures of all the products finished, so please continue to watch. And yeah, thank you again.